strange light fills the room. Twilight is shining through the barrier. It seems your journey is finally over. You're filled with determination! Human, ah, uh, it was nice to meet you. Goodbye. Oh! What a miserable creature torturing such a poor, innocent youth. Do not be afraid, my child. It is I, Toriel, your friend and guardian. At first, I thought I would let you make your journey alone, but I could not stop worrying about you. Your adventure must have been so treacherous, and ultimately, it would burden you with a horrible choice. To leave this place, you would have to take the life of another person. You would have to defeat Asgore. However, I realized I cannot allow that. It is not right to sacrifice someone simply to let someone leave here. Is that not what I have been trying to prevent this whole time? So, for now, let us suspend this battle. As terrible as Asgore is, he deserves mercy too. Tori, you came back. Do not Tori me, dreamer. You pathetic whelp. If you really wanted to free our kind, you could have gone through the barrier after you got one soul, taken six souls from humans, and come back and freed everyone peacefully. But instead, you made everyone live in despair, because you would rather wait here, meekly hoping another human never comes. Tori, you're right. I am a miserable creature. But, do you think we can at least be friends again? <sighs> No, Asgore. Nyah! Asgore! Human! Nobody fight each other. Everyone's gonna make friends, or else I'll... I'll... Hello, I am Toriel. Are you the human's friend? It is nice to meet you. Uh, yeah! Nice to meet you. Hey, Asgore, is that your ex? Jeez, that's rough, buddy. <laughs> hey, hey! Nobody hurt each other! Oh, are you another friend? I am Toriel, hello. Uh, hi. There's two of them? Hey, nobody fight anyone! If anyone fights anyone, then I'll be forced to ask Undyne for help. Hello. Oh, hello, your majesty. Psst, hey, human. Did Asgore shave? And clone himself? Hey guys, what's up? Th that voice! Hello, I think we may know each other. Oh hey, I recognize your voice too. I am Toriel. So nice to meet you. The name's Sans. And, uh, same. Oh, wait, then... This must be your brother, Papyrus. Greetings, Papyrus. It is so nice to finally meet you. Your brother has told me so much about you. Wowie, I can't believe Asgore's clone knows who I am. This is the best day of my life. Hey, Papyrus, what does the skeleton tile his roof with? Hmm, snowproof roof tiles? No, silly, a skeleton tiles his roof with... Shingles! I changed my mind! This is the worst day of my life. Come on, Asgore, it's gonna be okay. There are plenty of fish in the sea. Yeah, Asgore. Undyne's totally right about that fish thing. So sometimes you've just gotta, uh, stop going after furry boss monsters and, uh, to just get to know a really cute fish. It's a metaphor. Well, I think it's a good analogy. Oh my god! Will you two just smooch already? The audience is dying for some romantic action. Hey, shut up. Man, the nerve of that guy. Right, Alfie's? Uh, Alfie's? No, he's right. Let's do it. Well, uh, I guess if you want to, uh, then don't hold anything back. Well, wait! Not in front of the human. Uh, right, sorry. I have got a little carried away there. <laughs> My child, it seems as if you must stay here for a while. 
but looking at all the great friends you have made, I think... I think you'll be happy here. Hey, that reminds me. Papyrus, you called everyone here, right? Well, besides, uh, her. Um, anyway, if I got here before you, how did you know how to call everybody? Let's just say, a tiny flower helped me. A tiny flower? Oh god, no. You idiots. While you guys were having your little powwow, I took the human souls. And now, not only are those under my power, but all of your friends' souls are going to be mine too. Hee hee hee. And you know what the best part is? It's all your fault. It's all because you made them love you. All the time you spent listening to them. Encouraging them. Caring about them. Without that, they wouldn't have come here. And now, with their souls and the humans together, I will achieve my real form. Hee <laughs> hee. Huh? Why am I still doing this? Don't you get it? This is all just a game. If you leave the underground satisfied, you'll win the game. If you win, you won't want to play with me anymore. And what would I do then? But this game between us will never end. I'll hold victory in front of you just within your reach, and then tear it away just before you grasp it. Over and over and over. Hee hee hee. Listen, if you do defeat me, I'll give you your happy ending. I'll bring your friends back. I'll destroy the barrier. Everyone will finally be satisfied. But that won't happen. You. I'll keep you here no matter what. Uh-oh. I can't move! Even if it means killing you a million times. Whoa! What's that? What? Do not be afraid, my child. No matter what happens, we will always be there to protect you. Oh, wow. That's right, human! You can win! Just do what I would do! Believe in you! Hey, human! If you got past me, you can do anything. So don't worry, we're here with you all the way. Huh? You haven't beaten this guy yet? Come on, this weirdo's got nothing on you. Technically, it's impossible for you to beat him. But, but, but somehow, I know you can do it. Human, for the future of humans and monsters, you have to stay determined. Aww. All the monsters are here, too. Erg! No! Unbelievable! This can't be happening! You... You... I can't believe you're all so stupid! All of your souls are mine! Oh god... My game gonna crash again. Uh, oh, what? Hi. Finally, I was so tired of being a flower. Howdy, Slim. Are you there? It's me, your best friend. Oh my god. Asriel Dreamer. Wow, um... Hope. You hold on to your hopes. You reduced how much damage you'll take this turn. And... Oh my god! Wow!
Oh my god! Whoa, what the hell? Oh my god, this is insane. I don't care about destroying this world anymore. Chaos Saber? After I defeat you and gain total control over the timeline, I just want to reset everything. Oh shoot, I died. Oh, but it refused. Okay. Do I have to start the whole battle over, or is it just that phase right... Well, no, because the colors are already here, so... Oh my god, guys, this is insane. Wait, charge is Shocker Breaker. Uh, oh. I was on Chaos Saver. Spare? Aw, oh, damn it, I died again. Okay, it's gonna keep on doing this, I guess. <laughs> okay, so let's attack again. This one's not as bad. Still freaking hard though. <clears throat> okay, chaos. Okay, chaos saver. That's this one again. Okay. Oh, I can use this, I guess. Wait, last dream? Tomb Nation, the dream became true. You recover, okay. All your progress, everyone's memories. I'll bring them all back to zero. Then we can do everything all over again. So I think it just resets like certain parts of the dialogue over again or something. Okay. Again, it sucks when I have, like, so little health, though. I really wish I had more, um, hope. So one thing I can do is, uh... And you know what the best part of all this is? You'll do it. Taste the rainbow! <laughs> okay, Chaos Saber. So I can do this. And then you'll lose to me again. And again! Shocker Breaker 2. Oh, Shocker Breaker 2? 
And again! <laughs> Oh shit, okay, I almost died. Galacta Blazing, oh my god, these are pac moves. Because you want a happy ending. Yeah, I kind of. Well, the stars are doing something different. I mean, they're still bullet elling around, but like... Okay, let me... I'll eat some chips. Because you love your friends. Yeah, my friends are pretty cool. Okay, the dream. Your items fill up with dreams, okay, because you'd never give up. Whoa! Shocker, Breaker 2 again. Let's do Hope. Isn't that delicious? Your determination, the power that lets you get this far. It's gonna be your downfall. Okay. As you already is Hyper Goner. I don't know if I like that. Hey guys, sorry, little post commentary here. Um, due to the nature of this battle with all those strange visual effects and the epic music and everything, uh, my video started lagging pretty hardcore and it kept skipping a few things and the audio got majorly desynced. I'm going to try to fix it as best as I can, uh, but again, just don't be surprised if uh, there are some little scenes and little pieces of dialogue missing. Dude. Even after that attack, you're still standing in my way. Wow, you really are something special. But don't get cocky. Up until now, I've only been using a fraction of my real power. Let's see what good your determination is against this. Oh, hello. Um... Can't move your body. Behold my true power! Ouch. Oh man, that's gonna be... I mean, at least this still happens. Every time you die, your grip on this world slips away. Every time you die, your friends forget you a little more. Your life will end here, in a world where no one remembers you. The whole world is ending. Still, you're hanging on? That's fine. In a few moments, you'll forget everything, too. That attitude will serve you well in your next life. The whole world is ending. Ha <laughs> Still? Come on. Show me what good your determination is now. Man, this is tough. You can't move your body, nothing happened. You struggle, nothing happened. You tried to reach your save file, nothing happened. You tried again to reach your save file, nothing happened. Seems saving the game really is impossible. But, maybe, with what little power you have, you can save something else. Oh, wow. Reached out to Azrael's soul and called out to your friends. They're in there somewhere, aren't they? Within the depths of Azrael's soul, something's resonating. The lost souls appeared. Oh no. You hug the lost soul and tell her that you're going to see her again. Something about this is so familiar to her. Oh, and they have their attacks too. Oh man, that's awesome. Lost souls stand there. Um, mercy. You refuse to fight the lost soul. Something about this is so familiar to her. 
Oh my god, this is awesome. Also, I love this song, by the way. You tell the lost soul that you prefer cinnamon instead of butterscotch. Somehow, she faintly recalls hearing this before. Stand there, okay. You stare deep in the eyes of the lost soul. Suddenly, the memories are flooding back. Your fate is up to you now. You are our future. Feel some. Oh my god, this is. You asked the lost soul to cook something for you. The lost soul is trying to hide its joy. Put the lost soul a bad pun about skeletons. We seem to hate it, but the other lost soul seems to like it. <laughs> okay. He asked the lost soul for help with a puzzle. He doesn't know why, but he really wants to help you. Tell the lost soul you think the jumble is tougher than the crossword, and nods its head like it knew this without question. No, wait, you're my friend! I could never capture you! Nah, I'm rooting for you, kid. Okay, Undyne's next. You clashed against the lost soul with all your might. He feels your fighting spirit. It's familiar somehow. He asked the lost soul to teach you how to cook. He doesn't know why, but she kind of wants to teach you how. The lost soul stands there. You tap the lost soul lightly something about the way you fight. It's all flooding back. Well, some humans are okay, I guess. You ask the lost soul what her favorite cartoon is. She can barely hold back from giving you an enormous answer. Oh, I don't hate you at all. You ask the lost soul for help on a quiz question, she barely holds back from giving you the answer. You tell the lost soul that you'll continue to support her. Suddenly, she remembers. It's all flooding back. No, that's not true. My friends like me, and I like you too. You feel your friend's souls resonating with Nazriel. Strangely, as your friends remembered you, something else began res resonating within the soul, stronger and stronger. It seems that there's still one last person that needs to be saved. But who? Suddenly, you realize. You reach out and call their name. friends souls resonating within Azrael what, what did you do 
What's this feeling? What's happening to me? No, no, I don't need anyone. Stop it! Get away from me! Do you hear me? I'll tear you apart! Slim, do you know why I'm doing this? Why I keep fighting to keep you around? I'm doing this because you're special, Slim. You're the only one that understands me. You're the only one who's any fun to play with anymore. No! That's not just it. I... I... I'm doing this because I care about you, Slim. I care about you more than anyone else. I'm not ready for this to end. I'm not ready for you to leave. I'm not ready to say goodbye to someone like you again. So please, stop doing this, and just let me win! Stop it! Stop it now! Slim. I'm so alone, Slim. I'm so afraid, Slim. Slim, I... I... I'm so sorry. I always was a crybaby, wasn't I, Slim? I know. You're not actually Slim, are you? Slim's been gone for a long time. Um, what? What is your name? Frisk? That's... a nice name. Frisk. I haven't felt like this for a long time. As a flower, I was soulless. I lack the power to love other people. However, with everyone's souls inside me, I not only have my own compassion back, but I can feel every other monster's as well. They all care about each other so much. And they care about you too, Frisk. I wish I could tell you how everyone feels about you. Papyrus, Sans, Undyne, Alphys, Toriel. Monsters are weird. Even though they barely know you, it feels like they all really love you. Haha. <laughs> Frisk, I... I understand if you can't forgive me. I understand if you hate me. I acted so strange and horrible. I hurt you. I hurt so many people. Friends, family, bystanders. There's no excuse for what I've done. What? Frisk, come on. You're... You're gonna make me cry again. Besides, even if you do forgive me, I can't keep these souls inside me. The least I can do is return them. But first, there's something I have to do. Right now, I can feel everyone's hearts beating as one. They're all burning with the same desire. With everyone's power, with everyone's determination, it's time for monsters to finally go free. destroyed.
Prisk. I have to go now. Without the power of everyone's souls, I can't keep maintaining this form. In a little while, I'll turn back into a flower. I'll stop being myself. I'll stop being able to feel love again. So, Frisk, it's best if you just forget about me, okay? Just go be with the people who love you. Frisk, you're, you're going to do a great job, okay? No matter what you do, everyone will be there for you, okay? Well, my time's running out. Goodbye. By the way, Frisk, Take care of mom and dad for me, okay? Frisk. This is all just a bad dream. Please, wake up. <laughs> 